Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and if you're new here, welcome to my channel. So, I'm having surgery to have my tonsils removed next Thursday, and kind of on this topic, I was talking to my sister and my mom, and we talked about some funny stories I had coming out of anesthesia or staying under anesthesia, because I don't do well coming out or staying under. Um, I haven't any of the procedures, any of the surgeries I've had. I always have, like, a funny story about either going under, coming out, or staying under. So... I wanted to go ahead and tell this story about the time that I ripped the IV out of my arm during a procedure. So I have always had stomach issues and like gallbladder issues. I had my gallbladder removed when I was 15 and this, I've always had like colonoscopies and endoscopies, endosco endoscopy, endoscopy, whatever. I say endoscopy, that's what it's spelled like, but whatever. So, I was scheduled to have an endoscopy, 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 whatever, and colonoscopy on this day. So, I get there, everything's fine, I go under just fine, but when I wake up fully from surgery, I wake up to them changing me. And I'm like, what is going on? Why are they changing me? And the lady told me that I woke up halfway through and ripped my IV out of my arm. Like... I guess I wasn't fully awake, but I woke up, woke up halfway through very agitated and completely ripped the IV out of my arm. So I had it in this arm, my right arm. When I woke up, I had it taped, like severely taped every which way to my left arm because I had woke up and ripped it out. And that's just so funny to me that that actually happened. And then my second story is I had my gallbladder removed and when I woke up from my gallbladder being removed I couldn't breathe I was like scream like I could obviously breathe because I was screaming but like I internally felt like I couldn't breathe and so they had to put a mask on me and I was like screaming for my mom and screaming about how I couldn't breathe and so they had to put like the oxygen mask on me and had to wait for me to had to wait for me to calm down and I just remember sleeping for like four days after I had that surgery. I don't know, like, what it was. I don't know if it was the medicine or what, but I had that surgery. It took me forever to wake up in the recovery room. I have some pictures. If I can find them, I'll insert them. But I have some pictures from that, like, surgery of the recovery, and it's just so funny. But, yeah, that one I woke up and could not breathe coming out of it. And so when I have my surgery on next week, I am so nervous to see, like, what happens coming out of it especially, but staying under, coming out of it. So now they have to give me, like, more than they normally would to make sure I stay under, but I'm scared of, like, the coming out of it process. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!